Hey everyone, this is Kawana Gamer here, and I'm back with more Let's Play Crash Bandicoot 3. The last time I was here, I managed to get some relics from Warp Room 1, and I'm just carrying on to continue the rel gathering the relics from Warp Room 2, and today I'm going to start off with Tomb Time. And first of all, I'm going to get rid of these boxes before I start the run. So I see if I can hit the clock from there. Right, there we go, right, I see. And what's also weird is that the Aku Aku mask goes away when you start the time trial. Oh, come on. Oh, that was a bit of a fail. I know that the uh, Sapphire time for this is a minute 41 seconds, so hopefully I should get more than that. Oh, that was quite a good... That's a good trick to pull off there. Instead of just hitting the exclamation mark switch at that point. Oh, no. Okay, I completely mucked that one up. Crap. Never mind. Oh, never mind. I'll die anyway because I had a bad run there. Let's try this again. That was quite a bad run I had there, but I'll try again. I was hoping to get invincibility there, but I never managed to pull it off. Okay, let's try again. Yeah, I don't want to die like a lot of times in these time trials because, well, I can't really afford to do that. See, what's also not good about the crash dash ability is that sometimes if you want to jump on the switch, uh, you won't be able to get to the switch you want to go to because crash will just simply run past it that easily. Right, there we go. Oh, never mind. Oh no, come on! I need to take out that guy with the flamethrower quite quickly. This is kind of a fail that, that's happening already, come on. Let's try it again. Please say it be third time lucky. I really don't care what relic I get, as long as I get one, as I said before, in these time trials. Okay. I might not talk a lot here just so I can concentrate, so... Okay, no, not good, not good, not good. Crap. Right, there we go. Just go that way, I don't care. Fat, no, do you know what? No, die. Because, oh, okay, Java apparently popped up on my computer there. Sorry, let me try this again. In fact, I'm tempted to re-record this because of the failures I've had already. Plus, I had to just restart the computer because Audacity was not recognising my... Well, it was recognising my mic, but it wasn't... Uh, it wasn't picking up the audio for some reason. Like, it was just complete and utter silence every time I spoke. So I restarted the laptop and it just picked up the audio, which was kind of weird. Okay, come on, can do this. Right, come on, I can do this. Right, that was about the time I had to waste there to get rid of that guy. And the good thing about this is it restarts your invincibility, and I want to go down the death path because there's a lot of uh, time crates on this bit. Oh, come on. Oh, yes, just made it. Oh, come on. Okay, good. Okay, good. Right, let's go, go, go. Can I get a good relic here? Oh, still a sapphire. Okay, doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. I got a sapphire. I should have got a gold for that, honestly, because, I mean, really, I mean, getting a gold time for that level is pretty hard. Okay, so that was a few minutes I had to waste there in tomb time because I ended up, kept dying. So, but I got a relic nonetheless, so... What oh, was a gold time anyway? Again, very close to a gold. 
I'm tempted to go for that relic again, but at the same time, no, I'm not doing it. I'm not going for that gold relic again. I'm just going to go for what I think would be best. Oh, I mean, I could have done better, but you know what? I just don't care, so... Anyway, now it's time for Midnight Run. Now, for the trick for this again. Hold down the circle button when doing this. Okay, right, I missed a two-second box, but it doesn't matter. Just keep going. Run. Okay, and the Aka Aka masks will definitely come in handy in this one. And I missed a three-second box. I got... Oh, God. I may, have, I may actually end up dying in this because... Well, I keep running into enemies and plus I'm missing a lot of time craves. Oh, okay, right. Do you know what? Just take the hit. Because I missed a lot of time craves anyway, so... I didn't want to miss that many time craves. I expected to miss some, but not a lot. So let's try this again. Okay, yeah, that's the trick. Just slow down for a bit to collect all those time crates. Okay, again, another Aka Aka mask. Okay, good. Right, okay, don't hit the enemies. I know, I had to slow down there for a second because, uh, as much as I want to just keep running through this level, at the same time it was very risky. I don't want to do that. Oh crap, miss the Aku Aku, I don't care. I like in uh, go. What did I get? 25 seconds. I think this is going to be another sapphire, to be quite honest. Let's see if I'm right. Oh no, a gold. That's a gold relic. Okay, I'm happy with that. That's the second gold relic that I've collected in the time trials so far. Okay, now. I'm not going to go straight to Warp Room 3 afterwards. I'm going to go to the Warp Room 6 because the yellow gem is still yet to be collected from Hang'em High. And I know that Skull Crusher or Zombie Hunter, I know you mentioned that there's a glitchy way to get the gem. But to be quite honest, I'd rather go for the legit way because I've never done it the glitchy way before. Now many people say that the relics are useless because, well, well not many people say, but some people say that the relics really aren't that put to good use. Well it actually is put to good use because, well, you get the yellow gem from this and it puts the relics to good use. I mean, sure it is, like, fun to find on the secret path, but to be quite honest, it actually is a lot better when you're... Oh, okay, that was a bit of a close call at the very start of the level. Okay, I'm just gonna shoot these guys. I'm not gonna... Uh, spin them or anything. I know I could, just to save myself some time, but I'd rather not. Just shoot them with the bazooka. But anyway, I think the relics are, are a great challenge in Crash Bandicoot 3. Okay, so get rid of these nitros. This will make things a lot easier by just blasting the nitros away. Although, that's easy as well, just jumping over them. But getting rid of them will make your life a lot easier as well. Okay, that's the yellow gem collected. Okay, now I'm just going to exit the level. And hang him high is officially done. So yeah, people say that like putting the relics in this is like not really good and like it's... It's... I don't know. It's just some people don't like this game. I mean, fair enough. I mean, it's their opinion personally. I mean, I think it's one of my favourite Crash games. But uh, anyway, on to the next level, Dynamite. So I'm going to come back, like revisit this one and collect both gems. And now that I've got the yellow gem, I can actually use the, the yellow gem path to collect all the boxes and get both gems from the yellow gem path and also for the box gem. Oh, whoa. Okay. Keep in mind it has been a while since I've recorded, so I might be a bit rusty at this, which I'm not really wanting to be, but so far I've done an okay job. Okay, 
so let's jump over that. Oh, a second, let me just turn that down a bit. It's a bit loud on my headset. Just so I can hear myself speak. Alright, now onto the other gem path. As you can see, this is not only a death path, but also like, a good place for boxes. So let's see. Yeah, I have to be careful as well not to run into those crash fish. Which I thought was like, oh, well, that's a unique enemy, I think. I mean, well, I don't think it's a lazy way of creating an enemy, it's not. Oh god. Uh, there we go. I thought I jumped on it, but I spun it, but I jumped on it, so. Okay, that was quite risky there. I thought I would have caught the TNTs uh, uh, with my body slam, but oh, I didn't, so that's always good. Okay, I was hoping to get more than one box in that. Ah, there we go. Just wait for that TNT to go off. And I believe after this you got to do a bit of backtracking, so I'm gonna have to prepare for that. Okay, checkpoint on oh, this uh, chase. Now this one's harder than the red gem one because there's nitros all over the place. Well, not all over the place, but at the very beginning. Oh god, damn it! Like all over the like at the very beginning because you could easily run into those nitros. So I'm just gonna take my time here. Right, not falling for that again. Oh. Oh, whoa. Oh. oh, that was close, actually, very close. And that's it. The yellow gem path is done. I'll just get rid of these nitros. Okay, I'm not going on that yellow gem path yet because there's an extra bit here where you can get five lives. Well, not that I needed them, but no, I don't think there's anything over this one. It's just a large steel crate wall, and you can't uh, double jump over it. So, I'll go back to the main level. Okay, now this is where I'm going to do a bit of backtracking here, so I'm just going to be very, very careful. Now, hopefully I will not die. In fact, I'm going to have to use my Death Tornado Spin to put my Death Tornado Spin in use here. I believe there's an enemy here. Yeah, after this uh, box. Oh, there we go. I thought so. I knew there was an enemy there. Whoa. Right, that was close. And there was another one there. Ah, and there's a, a T-Rex. Now that I've got a checkpoint, I don't have to worry about backtracking anymore. Oh, no. oh god, damn it. Lost him. Never mind, at least I got a checkpoint though. That's all, I, that's all that matters. As long as I don't have to do any more backtracking. Well, I still am, but... Okay, let's see if I've got to... Uh... Oh god. I didn't know that jumping on the spinning crash fish would give it to my head. Uh, well, T Rex. Okay, right, that's backtracking done, and now I'm gonna have to go back to where I was, so. I don't know if he's still there, or if he's gone now. The baby T Rex, I mean. But no, the relics are good fun, and uh, I understand that this game may not be a, a favour in the Crash series, I mean, well, but the thing is, though, I don't see why this, sh this shouldn't be a favour. I think it's a fun game. I don't see why people are really, like, disliking it. Well, it's just some people that...